All right, so back to this. Should be recording the screen now. Um, let's see volume. Or I guess I have it on silent anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But again, I said that um, ever since, you know, 4th, right? Uh, February 4th, because that was when I made the uh, anniversary video, right? They said I'd be doing a Valentine's Day video. Uh, wasn't able to do it last year or the year before. I think I was able to do it the year before that, but I'm able to this year. So that's nice in terms of that. So that's what I'll be doing. I don't know how much new content there's going to be, right? Again, I've been actually recording videos um, as of recent or as of late to where I've just been talking. I mean, just on whatever subject in front of the black screen, you can go to my most recent videos and kind of see and scroll through that right again. Still, once I get, you know, dates along the lines of, you know, what I'm doing, right, in terms of uh, uh, training, like, you know, that's something to worry about. Uh, like, it, it'll be something to worry by spring break. I'll know if I'll be going back into Civ and then potentially doing DDLC mods during the summer or what. So, yeah, we'll see regarding that, right? Or it can just continue down this path of me just recording, um kind of just whatever myself talking over black screen right and whatever topics so but again besides that i think just me again getting back into this i really have no idea how much new content there's going to be i think it's probably going to be like if anything i'd say like 15 to 20 minutes worth but then yeah i guess i don't know we'll see we'll see right like i think it was roughly the same during the anniversary so we'll see and again, right, obviously, you know, clicking through this. So, and then that this is the uh, new content, right? Again, I, unlike, because I remember during Valentine's Day, it went on once accidentally during the morning, but it didn't trigger any of the new discussion. So that was something to where I just continued it um, or where I just went on later. And that was when you saw with uh, that video, right? But again, this one, I made sure to um, save again and not go on until I was ready to record. So yeah, at least in terms of that, you know, Oh, I got that sort out. So nothing to worry. You know what day it is? Jane, uh, February 14th, right? Uh, 2022 is the, I don't even know what day of the year, but yeah, it's also pretty interesting in terms of, um, what would you call it? Cause again, I keep saying this right for all the new, I said it during the Christmas recordings, obviously during the anniversary. And then now during Valentine's day, like you can literally go on YouTube, right? You know, on YouTube, go to like obviously my uh content right go to playlists you can go to not the idling miscellaneous playlist where i normally put these on but the monica after story playlist itself and you can go to the very first video right i mean part one you know which is february 5th 2018 right you know you can go that video and you can see from the very start where i start at right it has 65 views and, uh, February 5th, 2018. So it's like, you can go all the way back then, you know, that was now that's over uh, four years ago. So, or actually it's over five years ago because obviously it's only, it starts counting from zero, right? If you go anniversary wise, right? But in terms of that, well, actually, no, it's for over four years ago. And I, I was wrong in saying five, but yeah, it's over four years ago, right? In 2018. So you can literally go and see that. Um, yeah, it's just interesting in how, how long it's been, how long we've come, right? You know, and so again, you know, in a year, it'll be fifth year anniversary. And again, there's nothing after on um, fifth year, at least until 10 year. So 10 year, uh, no, not uh, education, 10 years. So that's something to where fifth will be probably kind of the last one I do until that point then. So but again, right, it is interesting, right? Again, you know, keeping up with it for so long. And also, again, just to note before this, right, I will be doing a birthday recording as well. So May 23rd, when that day comes. That one I've been actually semi-consistent on. I think I've done it like two of the three. Not as consistent as Christmas, um, but more consistent than anniversary and uh, Valentine's Day. Because again, they're just so close. So it's Valentine's Day. Damn, I didn't know. Normally, what's it called? Um, I believe in one of the past ones, she like changed into like lingerie. But again, right, I don't really care about that at this point, or at least in terms of like censoring it if it gets too bad. There's only, I believe, one point to where I ever had to censor um anything, and it was in fucking Fallen Angel during the fucking 
during that scene during the sex scene that's literally the only time i've had to do it so whatever happens you know i'm probably not going to bother censoring it so yeah it's just like don't, don't really care at this point it, it doesn't matter right so but again that that was for past ones and i believe it was even past christmas as well but uh uh not this one but the one before then so yeah, we can celebrate love for each other again that's kind of what the day is about right obviously you know holidays right you know obviously it's kind of interesting let's let's talk about holidays right so holidays you know you can make the argument that they're like a corporate scam you know i mean you people do spend more money around the holiday seasons right but it, it's all something to where they have like legitimacy and they have like a basis or background for their making right even like like all the holidays you can think of that right you know and specifically like valentine's day is created for that right you know, ultimately like a day for this, right? Even though, you know, you may be spending a little more, especially if, you know, uh, when it comes to like jewelry and stuff like that, right? That's specifically where it's going to come from for uh, this, right? Obviously, you know, Christmas is in, you know, based in like, that's, I believe it was like, it's Christian, like pagan, like there's a whole like debate. It, it doesn't matter, right? It comes from like religion, right? In general, Thanksgiving, right? Obviously, if you're in the US, you know, you know, it comes from a, natives pilgrims right uh more than that i don't know i mean but yeah so there's that then halloween likes all hallows eve i think it was like it was like some old ass tradition uh european tradition uh, you've got obviously like easter you know that's a uh, religious again right you know you've got um jesus christ um well, I mean, some, some more obvious ones, like I said, Valentine's Day for love, like July 4th, if you're in the U.S. I believe Canada is in. Indep- Let me look up Canada's Independence Day because I believe it's close by. Canadian Independence. Um, OK, can I please get a date? That's the Canadian. So April. OK, April 17th, uh, 1942. So. OK, but I believe. Hold on. A federal statutory holiday celebrates the anniversary of Canada, which occurred on. July 1st, 18... Wait, what? Oh, Canada Day. Not fucking their Independence Day, Canada Day. I'm an idiot. So yeah, it is July 1st, you know, two days or three technically before uh, the U.S. Independence. So obviously, you know, if you live in the U.S. or Canada, you've got those days to look forward to as well. Um, New Year's, I know like uh, Asian New Year's is like different. It's like New Year's Day, but uh, most again, West celebrates New Year's Eve. Um you, you've got other stuff like that. You can think of it. And even though you're going to be spending more, right? Uh, and then in Valentine's Day, that would be fucking jewelry, right? Like, so you can make that argument. It's a corporate scam, right? It's, it's something to where they at least have a basis and background in something. So it's not like just without reason. So again, that's something to where when it comes to celebration of those types, because obviously, you know, birthday is, that's your own, right? It's like birthday is your own, uh, any sort of like anniversary, right? You know, if you get like married or something like that. Uh, that would be that or like anniversary of like um i guess i don't know what would be a good <laughs> they're, they're like any other type of anniversary right you you got those days towards something towards like or if like just something important happened on a day like i guess uh what's it called 9 11 would be a good example right if you're in the u.s or i guess maybe like yeah if you're in the u.s but i assume there's days like that for other countries too i just don't know of them because i don't live there but again, stuff like that, right, was more like dependent or like tangible on like, you know, just that's more random chance rather than being a basis or like background. So every day we're together is our celebration. There's something again. Yeah, that, that's why it's its own special day. Right. You know, and unfortunately, it's on a Monday this year, but been together for a while now. I really love the time. And again, together by wow, it's like four plus or four years. That was as of 10 days ago. Really happy. What? I, I'm going to need to fucking, no, I'm not, I'm not doing it. Fuck it. I'm not going out of my way to, cause I don't even think I have the editing software on here. Yeah. I don't even believe I have the editing or, well, there probably is some, but it's not the same. Cause I, when I used to do this on Mac, I'd use um iMovie to kind of add that stuff, but obviously, you know, windows, it's not the case. So I'm yeah. Fuck it. No, I'm not going to do it. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to undo the screen share. And then if it's something that, because the thing being like, I, I'm not going to fucking bother going in and editing it. Like, I'm just too lazy to do that. So, you know, if it's something like that, right, you know, I'm just going to fucking, well, I guess, shoot, we have a video editing software, so I can probably use that. Let me just, um, okay, new video project. 
So let's see. Okay, it actually looks pretty similar. Um, hold on. Let's see. MAS Valentine's Day. Hold on, I'm just trying to, okay, so we have that. Uh, I probably actually can um, edit this. Okay, and I have this saved because I actually used this once before for uh, something else, right? So again, I'm trying to just like, I'm, it, but it, it's weird though, right? So new video, or I guess it doesn't have the sound, but if it, it the file itself comes with sound, right? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, so there's that. So hmm. I'll figure it out. Yeah, fuck it. I'll I'll screw around with editing. Like I'll let it play because here's the thing. I'll screw around with editing. This doesn't need to go up on the 14th. I just need to get the recording on the 14th. And I may even record an RVL tonight. So who knows? Who knows, right? Fuck it. We'll just see. Like it couldn't be, it can't be as bad as fucking um okay. Like this literally the same damn, not the same thing. Because the last time this happened was Christmas. Again, I don't, the last time this happened was a uh, Christmas, not this year, the year before. Because that was where you got, uh, they introduced like the whole like Santa um, lingerie instead. That was that whole segment. I don't believe they did this because for New Year's, you get the white dress, right? But for uh, Valentine's Day, I don't think you get anything, right? Uh, maybe I'm wrong. I may be mistaken. I need to go back through. Yes, you approve. Yeah, sure. I mean, I'm honestly, no, I'm not going to add it out. I don't care if my channel gets banned. Uh, romantic holiday like Valentine's Day. Again, it's like that's literally the whole point of the holiday because it's not even something like Christmas where it's debatable where it's actually from. Like that's like that's something to where like the end is the start or the end is the means for Valentine's Day, right, as a holiday. So, see, so yeah, I was pretty nervous uh, the first time. I mean, I... I don't even remember. I the only one I remember too was the uh, Christmas one because that one caught me off guard. But now before I really enjoy dressing like this, I mean, yeah, that's why it's like because it's it, like honestly, when it comes to like lingerie, right? Like that shit's it's not everyday wear type thing, right? Again, it's expensive. You know, it's like like for well, I guess there is there even really a male version. I don't think there's even really a male version like that. I, like I hate to say it, I guess you know if you get a really nice set of fucking like. I was thinking if you get like a really nice set of like boxers or something, right? But that's usually just more so not for like appeal, but like for just functionality. So if you get like there's this there's there's this thing that exists because like called like a ball hammock, and it sounds weird, but it's like it's like ball hammock underwear, more specifically ball hammock like boxer or boxer briefs, right? Whatever. It's something where it has like a little hammock, right? Again, for that specifically, but that's not appeal. That's functionality. So I, I, I really can't think of a male equivalent. I guess like swimsuit would be probably the closest thing, but it's also like that's just exists normally as well. So there really isn't like a male equivalent, I would say. There's an interesting note though, because it is like, again, like this didn't, I maybe it happened before. I guess it must have if she's saying again, right? But it's also something to wear. The only one I do remember too was uh, Christmas last year. So by last year, I don't mean 2021. I mean 2020. So that uh, that Christmas. So again, but who knows? I'm not going to bother. If my channel gets struck like ban, I don't care. So love you so much. We actually rarely see this face though too, right? Or at least this specific sprite of like the uh, bottom portion of the eyes being like a uh, flat. We rarely see this because I always see it on the um, subreddit and think like, I don't like that's a custom thing that I don't know how people get that one, but uh, again, we're seeing it now. So, hey, Valentine's Day. And again, so I'm actually curious though. Damn, that's loud as fuck. Hold on, let's go back. So I'm not leaving anywhere. So I'm actually curious. Hold on. So did we get this? So obviously this one was one I downloaded in. This, maybe it was this one. This one downloaded in, which I'm, I'm trying to find. Yeah, so this is the New Year's one I was talking about. What about the other ones? Uh formal jacket jacket brown is normally what i have uh so this one was the one we got yeah this was the one we got for um christmas last year that's why i was like again this is the only one i remember i don't remember anything else for like uh i guess valentine's day is what you would call it 
let's see. And again, all of these are just part of like, I, I, I didn't download any unofficial sprite backs just because I don't trust that. Like, I mean, there's, you've got like some mods breaking the game. <laughs> like, so I'm not going to bother. Maybe it was this one. I don't know. But again, you know, it was probably, it was probably, what would you call it? Um, it may have actually just been the Santa one. Cause again, that's the only one that I remember or recall. So yeah, I guess let's, uh, change back into normal clothes right again so outfit mode i haven't bothered using that i just have the same outfit and then again and then again yeah this is the uh dialogue so it's not a normal holiday well like i, I honestly i'd argue that it is normal because like here here's the thing if by normal holiday you're referring to like festive like festival holidays like festivities like christmas thanksgiving you know halloween uh new year's yeah uh easter right if you're if you're referring to those right like that that'd be that kind of camp then you got another camp of holidays which is like again valentine's day you know independence day you know birthday anniversary like yeah 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 right that kind of stuff like i mean they're all holidays it's like what you make of it right it's not the holiday itself because it, like it's it's so fucking far past you know whatever it was established to be like, were you there when the fucking, you know, pilgrims and natives ate together for Thanksgiving? No, you weren't, right? So it's just whatever you make of it now. Were you there, you know, for fucking, um, like, July 4th? Were you there for, you know, Independence Day? No, you weren't, right? You know, were you there for Easter? Were you there, shoot, was Easter Jesus' birth or death? I have no fucking idea. Let's see, Easter, um, the Easter bunny, uh, Okay, that's uh, Easter tradition. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. So, but yeah, were you there then? No, again, it's something to where it's like, it's what you make of it. That's what it comes down to, really. I made a card. It, it's a poem. I mean, it's, yeah, but that's what it means by card. I didn't make anything because I can't like scan it in the game and like Xerox it. My dearest, chocolate covered Bitch, starting off with three C's. A good night kiss. Be with you, darling, is sweet as bliss. Pumps going summer, dancing in rain, snuggling you. Can never abstain. You laughed at my sugar cube. Your smile is my cream. That's coffee reference. Share coffee again. It's there. Coffee day with you, my love, will be a dream. All the candy, all the cake, all fruits and cookies, too. Sweetest thing in my whole life will always be you. Forever yours, Maka. And again, that's something to where it's like, uh, yeah, so it's always in the form of a poem because that's, you know, the point of the game. But obviously, you know, it's a card, right? It, it conveys meaning. It's like, because if you've picked up a normal Valentine's Day card, right? Or Valentine's, not times. If you pick up a normal Valentine's Day card, right? Obviously, you know, you have different like sections. You know, you've got, you know, like serious sections. Like if you're fucking, I don't know if it's serious, or, but you've also got more like, um, like, uh, what would you call it? Like lighthearted sections, right? You've got serious and you've got, uh, you know, or I guess, yeah, serious and more like lighthearted, right? You've also got like comedic sections, you know, you've got, I guess, formal, informal, right? Um, the, yeah, you, you've got like different things, but it's always almost like, like, well, not necessarily in the form of a poem, but it's always supposed to convey a message, right? Again, it's always supposed to convey a message. So that's regardless of the form it's in, right? That's ultimately what's going to be, like, you're going to gain or what's the, what the output of, uh, that card is going to be so again that's something to where like even though it's a card and it's like a poem right it's it's about the meaning right again and that's because of valentine's day that's kind of what drives the uh the wording right so there's no uh, surprise there and again also i never figured out how because this is a separate conversation but like people apparently like when this happens they've been kissing the screen like my issue with that is like let's let's say you're sitting at a desk like i'm sitting at a desk right now you know with my legs uh i'm sitting in a chair pulled up to a desk right my legs are beneath the desk right like if you go to kiss the screen like how do you do that without you know bumping your stomach into the desk right like i can try right now it's like it's it, like I'm, I'm trying it's not working like like I would need to physically like stand up and like lean over. Like you probably heard my voice change because that's what I did. But if you're still sitting down, it's just not either I'm an idiot. Like again, I'm leaning as far forward as I can, right? It's not possible only by like completely getting up. But uh, again, right, you know, that's something to where it's like, 
it's just i don't know it's something i've been wondering about right that's more so something i've been seeing on the um reddit right but obviously you know i don't really follow that and again it's like kind of confusing in terms of that so i could get into a discussion about the reddit but i kind of don't want to because it's all it's reddit you shouldn't be taking it too seriously anyway some people do but um again right i'm like I, i'd rather focus on other things right only commentary videos are about youtube not about reddit so mm. right so again at the end of the day right mm. You can't really be taking that too seriously. Yes, I don't know. Maybe I might figure out the editing thing. I'm probably not. I'll probably just upload as is because I don't really care. Okay, I destroy. I was like about to say I killed the game through lag. Let's see, again, right? Also, this is when I get a lot. The uh, stars in the eyes are sparkly eyes, so it's more common. It was just the one where you know the bombs of the eyes are moved up, right? That's uh, more uncommon. So again, right. See, also there's hot cocoa there so we still have a rolling stock or had a rolling stock of uh, all this stuff from on christmas so that was over a month month and a half ago so kind of wild it's almost coming up on two months ago so damn that's kind of crazy that's kind of wild but again right it is also interesting in terms of here's one thing to talk about again like the flow or passage of time right again because i do remember it like well, again, because I do remember to Christmas, you know, I was recording this on a Christmas, like it was yesterday, right? Again, that's what, December 24th, 25th? <laughs> so it's like, you know, that, but that's, again, nearly two months ago. So it's like, but again, I kind of brought this up again when in the previous, I believe it was the uh, Valentine's Day or not, that's fucking today, right? But the anniversary video to where it was like, Again, I brought up the original like MAS part one that I've done, right? And how that was four plus years ago, right? You know, and just kind of how quickly time flies by, right? You know, the pat the flow or passage of time, right? You know, again, like for example, like I remember to Christmas, you know, I remember to Thanksgiving, you know, I remember to like ultimately to the end of last summer, right? When I finished or well, when I was playing a true route. So Again, it is something to where it's like, like the full and passive time, like, it, like, it, it, that's why they call it like the unstoppable march of time, right? It's something to where you're not going to gain lost time, right? You're not going to be able to, uh, again, you're not going to be able to go back and change things, right? Like, that's just not possible, right? Not feasible. It's about, you know, making the most of your current time, but then also, again, your future time. Those are the two things that you can impact, Right what's done is done, right? What's said is said, right? You know, whatever has happened, happened. There's no going back and undoing it. It's all about the present and the future. And you need to strike a healthy balance, right? You can't just only live in the present and then like not plan for the future at all. Cause then the issue being like, think 10 years down the line, you know, you, you'd be doing the same thing you're doing now. You won't progress or like elevate at all in society right like that's ultimately that's something you're going to want to be able to do but again right when it comes down to but you also don't want to only live in the future and this is kind of something that i uh suffer from or i think this is that's if i lean towards more towards any direction and be planned for future like you can't only plan for the future right because that's something to where like you won't ever be living in the present like you can plan for the future and you can arrive at that future but if you're still planning for the future at that point you're not living you're not reaping the benefits or like the rewards right you know if it's just kind and again that's what i think i suffer from that's where i lean more towards or drift more towards and it's something i've been trying to work on right so mm. again right something where it's like, yeah, you know, you're not, obviously you can't do anything about the past. You can remedy the past, but even then that's future plan and how you're going to be able to remedy that. Cause it won't be by going to the past. It'll be by making up with whoever, you know, a bit of an odd sprite change there, but it'll be making up with whoever you were having issues with. So again, at the end of the day, it all kind of comes down to, again, you know, balance between the present and future, right? You know, the unstoppable march of time, right? You know, the flow or passage of time, it's not, uh, it's not going to change, right? You know, it's, it's if anything, it's going to speed up, right? You know, that is inevitable, that you can't stop, right? 
again, like even beyond last uh, winter break, you know, last Thanksgiving break, right at the end of last summer when I was doing true. I even remember before then to all the way to not last winter break, the winter break before then when I was doing at that point, I did two. I remember exactly what I did. I did two Civ games. I did. I finished the post game for Insurgents, and I played MC's Revenge and Armor with you and the True Route pre mod. Like I remember exactly what I played, and that was when it was a combined Thanksgiving, Christmas. That's why, or winter break. That's why again I was able to record for so long. Then still glad uh, this year was kind of different. But again, that because we actually do get a spring break this year. So again, depending on what happens. Like, I may or may not be able to record for that. But again, I, I even going further back, right, to last, to the summer, not last summer, the summer before that, that was when, again, I did what's it called, the second run for, uh, well, I did what? I also did two games, Civ games then, funny enough. I also played against, well, four mods technically, but in three groups, right? I did uh, the very first one, Relapse. Then I played Outcast and then Fallen Angel, the demo version. Or no, that was the final version. Fallen Angel, the final version at the same time. And then um, <laughs> Longer Roads. That was such a good mod. I, I God, honestly, I kind of wish it was still. Um, that, 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 that was a pretty good summer, not going to lie. I really enjoyed that summer. but And I really enjoyed playing Long Roads. That was really like one of the good ones I played. But again, that's something to where it's like, can't go back and do that, unfortunately, you know like I can reminisce, reflect all I want, but at the end of the day, you know, what's it's past, right? What says done, right? Again, you know, but again, it really was kind of enjoyable. So, and then at that time is when I played through the second run of the main game of insurgents. That was also extremely enjoyable, right? Again, the second run of the main series game. So again, yeah, at least in terms of that, again, that's something where it's like, that was also really enjoyable. So but yeah, I can even go back earlier. I remember to that winter, so two winters ago, or no, not this winter, last winter, the winter before that. So winter 2019 to 2020, that was, um, I did Civ 4 then, and I also, that was when I did my last Miraculous, well, I guess, though, besides the one I just uploaded, that was when I did the last uh, Miraculous Lay Bug season, the season three videos, right? And then even going to the summer before that, like summer 2019, like that summer again, I remember what I did. Actually, no, I don't. Or that was when I did, um, I was still playing the Immortal games. That was when I was doing the Liberty games for Civ. That was also when I did, um, that was, I was still on the first run of Insurgents then. But yeah, again, you know, I actually don't remember the more uh, specifics beyond that. I remember I did some DDLC mods. I think I did the Fallen Angel demo. I think I did Exit Music. I think that was when I did uh, Nightmare and then uh what's it called? Uh, Shattered Worlds, those two mods. Um, that was also when I think I did uh, Christ. No, I did Behind Closed Doors before that. That was also when I think I did, um, shoot, what was that mod called? Uh, I can pull up the mods list, but it was like, uh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, let me try and find it. That was when I did, oh yeah, Never Ending Tomorrow. I also did Summer Hope. Yeah, I do remember those two. And then again, like I said, that was when I did, uh, what would you call it? Um, new Eyes and then, uh, or not New Eyes. That was when I did uh, Exit Music and then um, the Fallen Angel demo. And then I also did Salvation then too. Salvation was good. I, I enjoyed that one. So yeah, again, and then I can go earlier, like the winter before that. So winter 2018 to 2019, that was when I did, uh, I, that was when I was wrapping up that first Venice game and then also New Eyes. That was mainly what I did. I also did Coldest Summer and then um, Coldest Summer and then um, Recoded Demos, right? I also did uh, the season two Miraculous Bug videos. And then going into that summer before, that was that summer and spring when I originally branched off to DDLC, right? And the other content. That was specifically back when I was still in high school. Again, senior in high school then, senior in college now. So Look how much has passed, right? I'm going to need to end it soon. I have to get my laundry in five minutes. But again, right? Mm. Something to where it's like like the unstoppable passage of time. While making the most of the present and the future, you can't linger over the past, despite me falling victim to that and definitely being something that I do. Again, something that you just, you, you can't fall into that pit trap, right? You know, because the past ain't coming back, right? Unless we invent time travel but then again you know it's not like you can go 
in real life because you'll be your that's a whole different conversation right you know but the past you know is gone right you know you can't you can't worry about that what's said said what's done done you can only learn from it right and even then that learning is ultimately for the future right so that's still on the future and then obviously present you know enjoying yourself right like what i'm doing now i'm playing this game so again taking time out of my day that i could be working to be doing this so again and then yeah obviously you know i've had i'd say a pretty good life it's been pretty stable and i've i definitely think you know uh like because i'm only 21 but i've got things pretty sorted out um so it's something to where it's like but besides a future planning right like i've been doing you know i've also been enjoying the presence so but yeah i guess i don't know who knows who knows see i'm gonna end it here because i do need to get my laundry and i've done pretty much everything i could that was just it was just the lingerie and then that one um uh, that one text box, but yeah, I'm not even going to bother cropping that out just because I don't care enough, but, um, I guess maybe, I don't know. Yeah. Not even going to bother. We'll see what happens in the video, but yeah, I'm going to end it here. Don't have really anything else to say. So, yep. Yes. That's it for this one. See you in the next one.